Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to add the SSH keys to Windows Terminal. Uh, you can get the Windows Terminal from the Microsoft Store. Just go to the Microsoft Store and then in the search field type in Windows Terminal. then click install and uh, you will have this Windows terminal so now let's add the SSH keys to it so there is a command uh, that we can use to add the keys so I will show you so the command is SSH keygen minus T space RSA minus capital C and space in brackets uh, like how you want to name your key you can put your email address or whatever you want so let's do that okay and click enter and click enter if you want to save in this directory and if you want you can protect your key with the password uh, if you click enter it will be without the password Okay, let's confirm. And now we have the, the key generated. So to see where's the key, we need to navigate to C drive, users, Windows 10, and SSH. And here we have the public key and the private key. Okay, so now let's upload the keys to the remote server that we want to connect to. So I'm going to use the FileZilla to connect and the, my password and I'm not going to tell you okay okay so we are in the directory where the our public key is on Windows 10 so let's upload it to the Windows uh, the Windows public key to Raspberry Pi. Okay, so the public key is uploaded. We can close it. So the first time we're going to SSH to it, it's going to ask us for the password because the keys is not in the file yet. Okay, let's navigate to the SSH directory. So if we going to do this command cut Windows 10 IDRS pub and then append authorized keys and click enter but maybe let's add sudo and if we do exit now and try to log in one more time it's not going to ask us for the password because it's going to use the the keys that we generated so this is how you upload the <coughs> public key to Raspberry Pi and how to generate the uh, keys on Windows 10 with Windows Terminal thank you for watching bye